two small bodies of mass 10 kg and 20 kg are kept at a distance 1 meter apart and released. Assuming that only mutual gravitational forces are acting, find the speed of the particle when the separation decreases to 0.5 meter. Fine. Now let's say I do have a two particles that are kept at a 1 meter distance initially. This is my particle A, this is my particle B. Now the gravitational force will act between them and we know that the gravitational force is an internal force. So if and only if gravitational forces are acting between two particles then the linear momentum will remain conserved will be conserved alright so I can write initial momentum is equal to final momentum although initial momentum is zero because mass m1 let's say the mass m1 is this mass m2 is this so m1 into zero plus m2 into zero because initial velocity of both of them are zero is equal to final momentum so it will be m into let's say v1 and m2 into v2 fine so I'll solve this equation mass m1 is 10 kg let's say velocity is v1 that will be minus of 20 into v2 so v1 is equal to minus 2 times of v2 the minus sign shows that the direction of the velocity of v2 is opposite to that of v1 then of course if the velocity of v1 is in this direction then the velocity of v2 is in this direction fine so as of now I can neglect the negative value because that is just showing the direction so I do have this relation let it be 1 ok now initially there will be some gravitational potential energy fine the gravitational potential energy let be u1 will be given by minus g m into m by r substitute the value the value of g is 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 into 10 into 20 and the distance between them initially is 1 meter square so initial potential energy comes out as 13.34 into 10 to the power minus 9 joules with a negative sign fine and I'll calculate the potential energy when the distance between them is 0.5 so it will be minus again g m m1 into m2 by r and it will be minus of 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 into 10 into 20 divided by 0.5 whole square so it is nothing but minus 13.34 into 10 to the power minus 9 divided by 4 it will be into 4 fine this is joules and uh, now what I have to do is I have to conserve the energy that is the initial energy that was only gravitational potential energy that will be converted into the gravitational potential energy when the distance reduces to 0.5 plus the kinetic energy of mass 1 plus kinetic energy of mass 2 so just substitute the value I do have minus of 13.34 into 10 to the power minus 9 is equal to minus of 13.34 into 10 to the power minus 9 into 4 is equal to half of 10 into v square plus half of 20 into 2 v square fine let it be v so I'll calculate I'll put the velocity of 10 kg as v I'll put the velocity of 20 kg as 2 v fine so on solving this equation I get the value of velocity as 2.1 into 10 to the power minus 5 meter per second so this is the velocity of v1 and the velocity of v2 that is 20 kg will be 2 times of it so it will be 4.2 into 10 to the power minus 5 meter per second that is our answers